Marley, say ready. Woody! Because <laughs> it's a holiday. Merry Christmas. <laughs> happy New Year. Yeah, Happy New Year. Feels good. Feels good to be in a new year. Yeah. That one felt long. It's good to have 2022 <laughs> behind us. <clears throat> Probably our hardest year yet. Would you agree? It's been. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, uh, yes, no. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it was. We were on the receiving end a lot this year, too, of from people and and um we definitely lucked out a receive yeah that was a i guess a a skill that we uh we developed a lot more of this year which we're very grateful for the many people even just receiving prayers and things and fundraisers and gofundmes and so grateful if i talk too much about it i'll just start weeping so <laughs> we're so grateful so grateful I think both Colby and I were like so excited about the upcoming Christmas season that we just were like, let's do this. Like, let's, let's get the house decorated. Colby went all out, got lights strung up and put lights on the trees. And I think we were just so craving the holiday cheer and spirit that we just were so excited <laughs> to have it finally yeah. be here. Yeah. And the kids, too. I got them matching Christmas jammies, which our kids don't normally really wear jammies. And I gave them to them over the <clears> Thanksgiving <throat> break. And they were so excited about their Christmas <laughs> jammies. So excited. And it was cute to see them wear them the whole holiday season. We stayed at home, uh, yeah, during this during the holidays. But we had visitors, my parents and Emily's parents, and kind of had separate little unwrapping kind of like little Christmas Day, you know, festivities and things with them, which was great. The kids were ecstatic. Yeah. You know, it's kind of like they got three Christmases, <laughs> one from their Bell grandparents, one from their Miller grandparents, and then Christmas from mom and dad and a gift from Santa. We did get out a few times. We rode a Christmas train at the theater. We... Oh, something about this time of year, full of all this love and cheer, oh Christmas. It's Christmas. I see mistletoe on the know, and yes, I know there's nowhere I'd rather be next to our family tree. We'll watch the snow fall down. Christmas time's all here. Around. There's lights lining every street. Loving this air we breathe. Oh, something about this time of year. Frosty the Snowman. What did we do? Open presents. Open presents. What did we make? Mm. You guys just ate. Gingerbread houses. Gingerbread houses. Did you like eating it? Yeah. Did you like making it or eating it? Making it. Oh. I liked eating mine. <laughs> the frosting was gross. <laughs>
when we were in Taiwan a few years ago, we had heard about this place, Shifen, where you can send off Chinese lanterns up into the sky. And we went and we actually had already gone through Shifen and we went back to Shifen because we wanted to do it. And it was just such a neat, fun experience. And our kids were a lot younger that time, you know. So one day I was not sleeping at night and I just had this like lightning bolt of, we need to send off Chinese lanterns to celebrate the new year because we really, really want to let go of 2022. And some of the things that just didn't serve us and were really painful and difficult and we want to create something new. So I wanted to go into the future, focus forward on what we want to create and leave 2022 in the past and you know any of the behaviors and thoughts and fears and things that we realized were not serving us. So we, um, I ordered some Chinese paper lanterns and we talked about it with the kids and we sent them off and it was awesome. <laughs> yeah, it was. What was lanterns? Super, super fun. <laughs> What's your word for this year? I forgot. I forgot. Well, I only did. What was your word for this year? My word? Yeah. What? Love. Love. Zoe, what was your word for this year? Uh, okay. Create. Get excited because we got lots of content coming. We took mm -hmm. in 2022, it was a very long break. We were dealing with a lot of other things, me personally, to where I kind of put that stuff on the shelf. So lots of content coming soon. Yep. And um, a lot of people know I have a couple books that I've been working on, two specifically that are about ready to, well, I hope about ready. One's been to an editor. So stay tuned for those. Going to get them published as soon as I can. Happy holidays. Yep. Hope yours was great. Happy New Year. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Ho, ho, ho. And, happy New Year. and happy New Year. Happy New Year. Merry happy New Year. Happy New Year. I'm a wise man. I'm a wise woman. No, it was it was real. Marley had a good little conversation with him, huh? Santa Did you, you remember talking to Santa? Well, he doesn't want to sing, George. What was your f highlight of Christmas time? Getting my axolotl. Ooh, the axolotl. We have a new family member. <laughs>